You, you mentioned gay rights. Um, I was just wondering, do you think, what was your personal view on, on being gay? Do you think it's a lifestyle? Or? No, it's not a lifestyle. You can uh, read the books you want, I mean, all the articles. You know that there's a genetic difference. So it's not a matter of choice. But they're born that way. And uh, that's that. I mean, so if two men or two women are that away, just leave them alone. Whether they should be given rights of adoption is another matter because who is going to look after the child? That's, those are complications that arise once you recognize that you can actually legally marry them and you say, I want to adopt. But as far as I'm concerned, I believe it's... Vivian Balakrishnan says it's not... It's not decisively proven. Well, I believe it's in, there's enough evidence that some people are that away and just leave them be. This is more of a personal question. If one of your, your grandchildren were to... That's life. They are born with that genetic code. That's that. Uh, Dick Cheney didn't like gays, but his daughter was born like that, so he says, I still love her, full stop. It has happened to his family, so on principle he's, he's against it, but it's his daughter, so you throw the daughter out. <laughs> That's life. I mean, none of my children are gay, but if they were, well, that's that. Entertainment. Entertainment.